There is a bass right there looking at you. See? Got him. Told you there was a bass there. <laughs> <laughs> a little skinny one. Yeah, that's a baby. Yeah. That's a baby. <laughs> Get the skunk out. Yeah, well, fucking my bait's was bigger than the bass. <laughs> oh, he fell. Stop moving. You're done. <laughs> All right. What was that on your uh, dinger? Yeah. On the dinger. <laughs> okay. You can stand right there. Oh, look, I got one. Yeah. Got one. Yeah, there you go. Ooh. Good one, too. <laughs> Stay on. Like one. I wasn't even paying attention. Yeah, they're all skinny in here. I usually break the barb off so I don't have to sit here and pop them to get them. But you like the fur to slap it. <laughs> see, but I'm trying not to damage the fish. <laughs> see, this spot you always produces at least one, usually two or three. I just wanted to make sure I got my line out there before you did. <laughs> Not a bad one, probably 12 inches, 13 maybe. Just see, get a quick reference real quick. I don't know, he's 15, 14 and a half. Yeah. Got one. He had it for a while, I wasn't sure if I had him, so. A little. That's skinny Sanko. This is a nice size bait right here. Mm -hmm. Skinny Sanko. And he's setting himself free. Well, not quite, but. <laughs> there you go. Now my hand's all muddy. <laughs> I want to be checking out more new spots as often as I can, so. Even though we didn't catch anything, it was worthwhile for me. Yeah. Then again, I didn't drive. But got another one. Oh. That one looks good. <laughs> Those I, think, I think this is the same one I just caught a little while ago. Because he's got a hole in his cheek down here. Now, nah, it's smaller, but it's been caught before. <laughs> Told you it's good for a couple of fish. Damn you skinnies. I did learn, learn a new technique where you know you throw out your bait and you let it sit there, you pull in the slack, and then you start scratching your mosquito bites. And it puts just the right amount of wiggle on it. You're falling behind, Greg. I know, right? Loser buys dinner. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Got him. Oh, it's a sunfish. I knew I had one though. Oh, I thought it was a sunfish. No, it's a little bass. A little bass. This is still twice as big as the one I caught yesterday. <laughs> but this is why I break off the barbs because these little bass, those barbs will kill them. There you go. <laughs> Skinny Sanko. <laughs> kind of. It's always funny when you set the hook on a fish and it comes flying at you oh, yeah. <laughs> when you're stuck in a tree i'll be bringing in a fish look look look, look. Oh, yeah. ah. even with that hook set he still slipped off yep that was a good one too that was probably at least 15 inches actually i think i lost that one because i broke the barb off because that hook set, there's no way he wasn't hooked. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's just a... I break the barbs off, but I lose a lot of fish because of it. But, you know, doing catch and release, there's no point in crippling the fish. 
Now, if I was going to keep the fish and eat it, I would leave the barb on. 